Well, hello everyone. I see you're back for another Close Combat the Bloody First Adventure. Today I'm going to do the play the only battle I haven't played yet in Tunisia, which is Tyne Valley as the Germans. The fortunes of war have turned against us and the situation is dire. Contact with higher headquarters has been lost. We have no choice but to hold the approach to mature at all costs. All right, it's an ally attack in Tyne Valley. Force balance is pretty even. I have digging capability, uh, which is dubious at best. Um, still, I have a mortar and artillery strike. I don't really I know what he has here. It's 0600. A um, little bit of hilly areas, roads. Okay, we got Falsham Yagers. So let's just take it down to the bare troops. Um, looks like I got just all Falsham Yagers in one Zugfuhr. Uh, let's look at support units. I got one pack 38 and two MGs or two pack 38s and one MG. Now I'm pretty sure, yeah, the, the Fallschirm Jaegers only have one light machine gun per fire team of six men. But I think um, their morale should all be really good I would imagine you know they're all airborne yeah I mean I don't really think I need another uh, Zugfuhr um, so I think I'm just gonna go with oh let me put a couple of these subunits in we'll take a scout team which will give us a three-man We'll give this guy a scout team, which will give us a three-man machine gun team and a scout team. Uh, we'll do a tank hunter team, and we'll do the sniper. And let's fight. Like I said, this is the last battle that I um, that, uh, that from Tunisia that I need to complete. And right now I'm in the process of playing my son um, a multiplayer campaign in Sicily where he's the allies and I'm the axis. But I just got home from work and uh, I got a little time here to kill. So let's just do this. All right, big old square map. We have uh, four victory locations that are up for grabs. I own one and the allies, the Americans own one. So let's kind of look at the contour here. Let's get rid of this. Okay, we got hills, two ridges, and a valley with a little, some little hills. So what I can do is, uh, let me go ahead and put my guns up on the hilltops. Now, I don't know if he's got any armor or not. He looks like he's backed up against this edge. So I can put my guns up on these hilltops. You know, which gives me a, a wide field of fire. The only thing I have to really worry about is mortars. But one thing, when you place units on hills or these ridges, make sure you check and see if they're able to move. Because I've had a couple instances in previous games where I've placed a unit on a ridge or a hilltop and try to move them later on only to find that they couldn't move. So once you place a unit like this, um, give a move command and just see, see if it's, they're able to move. That's my little pointer for today. All right, let's uh, get this guy up on this little hilltop here. 
and he should have a pretty good field of fire too. You know what I mean? If there's any armor or vehicles, they'll, uh, they can knock them out. They can shoot HE at infantry, uh, mortars, whatever. Okay, now we got a heavy machine gun. So let's kind of put him in a, since I only have one heavy machine gun, I'm going to put him in a central location and maybe here. Is this? Yeah, it's pretty good. All right, we'll leave him here. So this gun will hot key him right now is six. Those are my typical uh, hot key assignments. Seven for guns. Machine gun, I'll give him a four. Uh... And I tank rifle. Let's see. Okay, now we're going to split the infantry up and say one, two fall shimyagers here, three fall shimyagers, one, two, three here, one two, three in the middle, and what do I got left? We'll do four in the middle. And then I have uh, Zook, well, let's put the Zook Fuhrer in the middle. Or, you know what? I'm going to put the Zook Fuhrer. These guys, I want to take this, and then I want to get up here. So maybe I want a little more firepower just in case he's got units back here. So I'll take that other. Let's see. Oh, we got. We'll take four. Balsham Jaegers and we'll give him. Um... I thought he had a scout team, but I guess I don't, right? Oh, yeah, spot troop. We'll put the scouts here. Uh, we'll put the anti-tank rifle in the middle somewhere. We'll put this guy on a flank, and we'll put the pan we'll put the Panzer Jaeger over here too. Okay, so this will be my main attack force. Um, these guys will be to provide covering fire. I'll just. Place them around here. Put the anti tank rifle here. Put a Falsham Jaeger here. Jaeger, Jaeger. And we'll put one. I've got the heavy back here, so we'll put one. Uh, we'll move him up, say, to here. Okay, that'll be our central force. So these guys, these units here, are gonna work their way up this side. So actually, you know what? We're gonna put one guy back here for covering fire. And we try to work these three guys up there. I'm going to put all three of these on ambush for right now. And we're going to go ahead and leave, well, put this guy on defend here, put this guy on defend here. We're going to put the Zugführer back here in the uh, mortar resistant area. So our Falsham Jager is going to lead the, uh, lead the charge. With these, uh, with these teams here. Spot troop. Let 
Yeah, they're bunched up, but we're on the edge of the map, so that all that pre that prevents us from getting hit by 180 degrees of mortars. So I'm not gonna make a big deal out of this. Um, we're just gonna go and I do have an artillery and a mortar barrage, so that should help. This should be relatively painless here. And we have a scout car. So let's go to seven. Can seven see him? Yeah. Can six see him? He's already uh, surrendering, right? Is that what I heard? I don't have any mortars. So we're just going to have to do this with the guns and the machine guns. I got plenty of firepower. Okay, they can't see anybody because they're behind a the hill, so I'm going to run these guys up this way. And walk these guys behind them. See if I can get see if I can get these guys maybe over to here. I have to walk them around, but I can still get them. Bug him out for the uh, artillery attack. I don't know how good that's going to help. Yeah, it should help him somewhat. Except for these guys up on top of the hill. But what about 6 and 7? Let's get them uh, in the action here. Might as well use the HG. All right, looks like these guys have been cleared out somewhat. Let's see if I can get some of these units up there. Let's just do this, put everybody on ambush. All right, I think uh, I don't really see any uh, good opportunity targets for my uh, artillery yet. So let's just go ahead and move these guys up here. Okay, start moving these guys up. going after these guys. Let's see, maybe uh, scouts in a bar team. What is this? Bar team, bar team, B-A-R team. I should really just call them B-A-R team. So if you're... Ah, let's hit him with some artillery. And let's hit him with the uh, mortars too. Seven, defend, six, defend. All 
Alrighty. Let's just get these, uh... Where's six? Get him involved here. Get that up. Five centimeter gun involved here. Where's seven? Get him involved up here. All right, as soon as this, this uh, mortar strike is over, I'm gonna go ahead and get these guys up on his ridge. Now I'm gonna, it's gonna be tough for me to get this now. Due to uh, a lack of units there, so this guy's gonna have to do some running. That didn't do a whole, yeah it did. I guess it did bust them up some. Verse six, get him on the heavy. Verse seven, get him on this one. Seven out of ammo? Maybe not. Yeah, he's got only got AP now. Wow. firing on that 30. Where's that angel dagger? Ah, uh, he got kind of broke. guys are kind of broke too so let me just go ahead and uh not bad for no mortars i guess who's he shooting at we got any uh High value targets here. He had his far team. I guess, oh, yeah, let's get him up on this hill more. I didn't get the last guy, but that's eh, all right. It's only a battle. All right, so that was short and sweet, and that concludes my Axis uh, battles in Tunisia. Okay, so sum it up. Enemy morale broke, and I did capture an additional objective. Major victory. 
Allies, 12 killed, 15 wounded, one captured, total of 28, one vehicle knocked out, the scout car. I had two killed, nine wounded, a total of 11 soldiers. We're going to go quickly, go through them. I just pushed. I wasn't really too picky about what I was doing. I just kept pushing. Didn't quite get that last objective I wanted to get, but in this particular case, it didn't really matter. Okay, because that's the difference between battles and operations or campaigns. So, hopefully uh, I can hook up with my son to do some more multiplayer in Sicily. So, as usual, until next time, have fun, guys.